What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I look like a fucking mess. I slept in my damn makeup once again because um I fucking ran out of makeup wipes and I haven't had a chance to go to the store to pick some up but today I did a little bit of shopping and I also have some packages from uh, companies and um some stuff that I picked up in LA from Los Callejones when I went. It was this week, but like I just I just have a bunch of shit that I want to show you guys. And also I went grocery shopping. This is probably only like the second time that I've gone grocery shopping. I pretty much only eat out because a bitch don't know how to cook yet. But uh, let me let me just grab my um my makeup wipes to take off my makeup. Finally, it is it's three o'clock in the afternoon, and I'm barely taking off my makeup from last night. It's tragic. These are the Neutrogena makeup remover wipes. These are bomb as fuck. Se te quita todo el maquillaje con estos. Like, they are so bomb. They fucking work amazing. But they're expensive. They get expensive, but if you go to Costco, they have a big pack of them. I think it comes with three, and then it comes with one free, um, one free uh travel size for like 20 bucks oh i feel so fucking better with my makeup off now like oh my gosh okay so like i was saying i've probably only been grocery shopping like once or twice like for real for real and um this was like my second time going and i kind of already have like the basics and by basics i mean just like <sighs> fucking like water and shit <laughs> But actually, bitch, I had ran out of water. I had to buy these two jugs. I feel like it's fucking easier to just drink from jug water because I never finished the damn water bottles. Now I understand my mom, dude, when she would fucking, fucking get on my ass all the time. Like, man, that was fucking dando cachetadas and shit. Just kidding, not really. But I for real feel it now. I'm always getting mad at Ali and I'm like, dude, finish your water bottle. Like, come on, like, finish your water bottle. Because he come... He, he be coming and drinking like this much of the water and leaving the rest of the bottle there and then like, you know, it, I just it's just left there, you know? So I'm like, what the fuck? So now I bought the galones because, bitch, come on, we cannot be wasting water like that or wasting money like that, okay? I'll get started with the first thing that I have. I don't know, this is a weird ass unboxing. I'm really excited to show you guys what I have in that fucking box because like, oh my God, you guys, like, Anyway, um, so this is the first bag. This is from Rite Aid. Um, again, I use these Neutrogena makeup wipes. These are bomb as fuck, but honestly, they do make my face oily as hell. So if you have oily skin, um, I'm not sure if they have oily, like an oily version of the makeup wipes, but if they do, you should probably get those instead. And then I got these um, charcoal pore cleansing strips. I want to do this right now because, bitch, I have hella whiteheads on my um, nose. And, like, now that I have really long nails, I can't really, like, poke poke them out. You know what I mean? So, oh, by the way, look at my nails. A bitch got her nails did. Bomb as fuck. And if you look closely, those are weed specks. Weed speckles. Look at them. Look at them. Oh, my gosh. Fire shit. And y'all already know that I'd be having some poppin' ass nails, for real. But, okay, I was walking by the uh, makeup section because I was grabbing the makeup wipes and I fucking saw the Maybelline Fit Me foundation, the matte one, and I missed it so much. This it was literally the first foundation that I ever, ever used. And, like, I don't know, like, it just brought me back. So I was like, damn, like, I'm gonna try to use it again because, you know, I, I need a fucking foundation that I can wear when I just look like a pito and I'm just trying to go grocery shopping or something. Wet your nose, the strip won't stick on dry skin. Wow, it won't stick on dry skin. You know what, I am gonna do it though. I'm just gonna do it. I'm back, I have this shit on. It is, I have this shit on. And bitch, I have this shit. I have this shit on and bitch when I say on it's fucking on like it's already getting hard as fuck and then I also have this random ass box this is uh Lodi London I think this is by Ciate 
and yes it is oh cute what is this oh these are the stamp liners wait what does that mean does that mean it's like a stamp like literally or is it like a thick ass jumbo pen eyeliner because honestly i hate those <laughs> Do you guys like those? I fucking hate those. I cannot get those to work like ever. Oh my god, it's literally a stamp. What the heck? Look at that. What the fuck? Wings made easy. <gasps> that is so dope. You do that. <laughs> Ah, you do it like that? Let me see. Let's get into the shit that I bought at the Gallejones. Um, honestly, I love to shop at downtown LA. Like, I fucking love to shop there. I got some shit for the rave uh, beyond. If you guys are going to beyond. Let me know. These are the shoes that I got. Um, I'm pretty sure these are knockoffs for Jordans, but I mean, I don't give a fuck. They're cute as hell. And they are the light up ones. Oh, yes, 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 yes. I love that. Oh my gosh, my nails against these shoes though. <gasps> These were 20 bucks. These were 20 bucks at the Cajones, you guys. Like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? Like, all this shit is the shit that you find at the mall for, like, 80 bucks. You know what I mean? They be overcharging y'all. So, honestly, just dedicate a day to go to downtown LA and you'll find whatever you need to find. I promise you. Next thing that I have is so fucking cute. And this was also pretty damn cheap because I know that this would be at least maybe, like, 50 bucks anywhere else else in the mall look at this look at this it's so beautiful it's so blingy like when you take it out into the sun it's like blinding dude like blinding literally when i went grocery shopping the girl was like thank you for blinging out my day today she was like i genuinely genuinely thank you and i was like oh shit i was like no you're you're welcome because dude like every fucking girl loves glitz and glam like who the fuck doesn't like that the next thing that i have is um this top from forever 21 um i don't even remember going and then um these rings and these were 590 i love to get rings like these because these are rings that you can literally just throw the fuck on I like to keep shit really simple for myself whenever i don't have a stylist or whenever i'm just like going grocery shopping bitch i keep saying that i go grocery shopping like all the time but i really don't like i really don't i just always say that but anyway this top is so fucking dope it just gave me like some vintage vibes so i was like bitch and this shirt was only how much was it it was uh 8.90 like you can make anything like cute girls stay tuned for my walmart video because you guys know the other day i was uh what, what did i do i think i uploaded something and it had like a cute shirt um, I ended up cutting it up and it ended up looking a bomb as fuck. I'm excited to show you guys this box here. I'm so excited. Okay, so if you guys smoke weed, if you guys are into that shit, hello, hello, how are you? A friend of mine actually introduced me to King Palms. If you guys already know of King Palms, you guys are fucking dope as hell because I just recently came across them and like, whatever, whatever. I'm getting too deep into this shit. But um, he introduced me to King Palm and like, I loved it. And he's like, yo, like, you know, they're actual like leaves. Like it's like palm tree leaves and like it's no tobacco. Like you can literally buy them because, you know, I'm obviously 19 and I can't buy like swishers or, or blends like that. I was like, dude, they're so fucking dope and then like me 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 of course i was like hmm i was like let me see if they have an instagram and i went and i checked and i was like hmm they have an instagram and i was like okay i think i posted just like a picture of them or, or like a, a snap of me like smoking them and i tagged them and they hit me up and they were like yo they were like we want to send you a care package i texted my friend i was like dude look who hit me up and he was like what the fuck and they sent me so much shit i still have a lot of stuff not not as much as i had in the beginning but you know there's still a lot of shit here so 
let me just show you guys the first thing and this is the one thing that i am the most in love oh shit i already showed you guys fuck pretend you didn't see that but this is the one thing that i really am excited about like ah oh, like i was so excited for this um let me just show you guys ready look at that well, now it looks a little ugly because I already smoked all those, but for my shoe, uh, stay tuned for that. You guys, you guys stay tuned for that. Um, but yeah, look at this. This is so many, like, and it's in the acrylic box, and I thought that was so fucking dope. The next thing that I have is this big ass box of, like, this is, bitch, this is literally the box that they fucking sell at the fucking smoke shops and shit. Like, they literally sent me a full box of the King, um, of the King, uh, rolls. I actually haven't tried one of these. I want to though. They're thick as hell So you can stuff a bunch of weed in them. I'm just gonna go ahead and peel it Oh Dude this hurts. Oh my gosh, I'm clenching my ass Was that even worth it? Was that even worth my pain, bro? Okay, well, there's not much to see is what my point is, and um, that upsets me because that was really painful. <laughs> Let me just say this. I don't know what the fuck I'm shopping for when I go grocery shopping. Like, I literally got there, I got to Trader Joe's, and I was like... <gasps> What am I supposed to get? Like I don't like I don't know I don't know a single recipe, bitch. Like not one single recipe. Not one. Here I have the first bag. This is from Trader Joe's. Um and the first thing I have in here is this a freshly squeezed orange juice. This is unpasteurized. And to be honest, I don't know what the fuck that means. I saw that there was another one that said pasteurized and then there was another one that didn't say that at all. I really don't know what the fuck that means, but I was just like, okay, well, I need orange juice. And I was like, fresh squeezed. <sighs> I want some of this. I love, love, love orange juice. And... You know, that helps keep you well, so. That's really good, dude. That is so fucking bomb. It is real orange juice. Oh, my God. Ugh. You know, like, when you drink something, like, zesty, your fucking shit's, like, squirt saliva? <laughs> so, the next thing that I grabbed were these, um coconut chunks these are frozen coconut chunks and i fucking love coconut and they just looked so fucking delicious right here like they looked so fucking bomb so i was like damn i was like i have to get these next thing that i have in this bag is this uh uh, chicken fried rice. I'm excited for this because it is instant and it is convenient And that is the number one thing that I love convenience One thing with me is I get freaked the fuck out with like food like this Like I have to reheat it like completely like on the stove or else I don't like to eat it Here I have the second one. This one is a little heavier and I thought this was so cute. And I was like, oh, look at my independent self. I was like, you have your own little carton of eggs. These are um, organic eggs. They are free range as well. So they have little freckles. How cute, little, little frecks. That's so cute. The next thing that I have is uh, this package of raw shelled hemp seeds. It says it has 10 grams of protein per serving. So I was like, holy shit, that is insane. So I plan on putting these inside of my smoothies and stuff. I also bought some bananas. Some bananas. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, so the next thing that I have are these uh, frozen vegetables. Um, I love these because it has like the little baby corns. And those are my favorite because it feels like, you know, like it's it literally tastes like corn, but it's like a baby version. These are really, really fucking bomb to eat. I hate tomatoes, like regular tomatoes. Like, I can eat these like literally like grapes. They're so, so good. They're so bomb. 
I also grabbed these sweet potato fries. Honestly, I wanted to get regular fries, but I saw the calories and like, you know, like obviously I should get sweet potato instead of regular. So that's what I did and I'm going to try these out. Hopefully they're fucking good. I feel like they're going to taste like ass, but you know, I'm open to it and I'm going to give it a try. I got some strawberries because I fucking love strawberries. What are these called? Fruit wraps. These fruit wraps. These are so fucking bomb. If you guys have not had these, like, they're honestly really, really good. Like, it's literally just fruit, right? Let me see. Yeah, it's literally just fruit. They're 50 calories and, like, it's a snack. Like, I actually reach for these. They're so good. My mouth is watering. Mm-hmm. Yeah, these are bombs. Those are all the groceries I got, like. So that is it for today's video, you guys. I have to put all my groceries away now and clean up. Perfect, I love it, I love it. Be sure to leave a like and I will see you in the next video.